Hola, ¿cómo estás? Ah, this is Jamie Lola Tallulah, Poet Spice, and I am here to do the February Gorgeous Girl collaboration. Yay! We are here to use our Gorgeous Girl dyes, stamps, papers, um, anything Gorgeous Girl related. Yeah! And the theme for this month was love letters. Love letters, love letters, love letters. Um, so yeah. Uh, <laughs> Okay, I know. Love letters. Um, I didn't want to go with your traditional let's do hearts, um, but you know, love letters and you can interpret that whatever way you want to. Um, so at the end of this video, want you please watch, subscribe, and like. And let me throw a little thing out there. I don't know if it's still going on by the time this video actually airs, but there is this um, thing that YouTube is screwing around with again um, for smaller channels. And if you know some smaller channels, that have less than a thousand views or less than a thousand subscribers and um, less than I don't know how many 4,000 hours of view time I think it is or if you know any smaller YouTube channels you know go check some of those out and do some watching and see what you can find on their channels and just like help them increase their view counts and so forth like that. Matter of fact, if anybody you like, just go ahead and do that anyway. Um, all right, so there's that. Now let me go ahead and get on with the collab. So let me show you all the crap I use because you know, when do I ever not use a bunch of crap? Okay, I have this die set that is kind of sliding down. And I want to say this was Amy, Amy Tangerine, and it was from Tuesday morning back in the day. There's a little love thing that's falling back, back here. I need some more, um, I need some more, um, uh, magnetic sheets. But anyway, so I use this frame, and I use this love circle down there. I used this die here the smaller loaf i use this x cut die that says friends always close at heart use that i use this is a Doris die and i use this rose um i use this die set stamp i guess this is a x cut day isn't it this one i used i did cut this out i didn't end up using it i used the cupid and a couple of the hearts and then the definitely the envelope and the little piece that goes in it if you do not have this set you need to go get it because it is uber fun and then of course i used i'll show you the two stamp sets i used i used this one i don't know if you can see that one very well whatever there's that one and then I used this stamp set and I forgot I had the dies on the back for these little things so I was like oh yay and of course we used gorgeous girl stuff so I used this die set and I used that one to create my gals so let me show you what I did I created two Little mini envelope pocket, stuffed envelope pockets. So to go with the whole love letter kind of thing. And instead of doing your traditional reds, I did something totally different using different card stocks. And um, yeah, so let's go with that. So first I have this one and it's so cute. I handmade the, the envelope. Using my, I was like trying to hear, I thought something was going on um, with the children. <laughs> I used the envelope punch board to create the envelope base. There's my gorgeous child right here. And I pulled the colors from this. So I've got the blue, yellow, white, and green going on. Okay. I have, there's that uh, Cupid cut. Um... I layered up the love with a regular circle. I had four, I had some of these little flowers left over, so I was like, I'm gonna use those. I created this little tag, and instead of being like romantic love, it's like love for your friends. So here's the little teeny tiny envelope with the little hugs enclosed, and then another heart. Special delivery, dearest friend, sending love. And then I have that little thing right there. This is that um, Amy Tan border, and then I just, put it on some white cardstock. 
here's that rose and so what I did was cut it about four times a piece glued them all together and so when it's done it'll be a sturdy little piece for the person then I also made some little embellishments but we'll go here I put a little layer of yellow paper on the inside and this love die cut which I forgot is actually a crafter's companion die so there's that and then that's what it looks like empty I thought that was so cute and of course I'm loving the non-traditional colors and then I did a little pack of embellishments so I made using those envelope dies and the little card that goes in it and it says thinking of you and then the little hearts and then I cut a little love cut a little love so there's two of those and then I made a different embellishment same envelope Hugs are better than email. And then this little piece from the X cut die and the banner. And I just stuck it on there just with a little bit of um, double sided tape so the person could just rip it off and then glue it down. And then I just put it on the card on the back in some little plastic. So that is this one. Let me load it back up. I mean, it's not a huge amount of stuff, but it is a little pocket. <laughs> and I thought that'd be cute just to send out. Oh, well, there you go. Let me put the little rows further up so there's one and this is a three by four envelope and then I did a three by three so here's this one and use the same similar you know similar elements and everything just different organizations so there's that circle of love backed on a punch there there's the banner here in silver here's the little girl and she's so cute love that and the other thing I did differently I showed this as tip in the video that I made but I did this differently on here too um, I cut it out and so you know the first layer cuts all the hearts out and then I turned it over and cut it again so that it left the hearts in on the second layer so it looks like they're puffy I don't know if you can see that looks like they're puffy through there and then I had some of those flowers and I wanted to use those up. So here was this one. If friends were stamps, I'd collect you with that little envelope there, little tag. And here's this tag. And I just backed it on some uh, craft. There's another one of those that I cut and layered up. And then another little package of little doodads so same concept just different ones and I wish uh, foil card didn't hold glue and fingerprint so much but there you go and then the back here's a little cupid and it's lined as well so instead of putting love on this one I put the cupid and then there she is so we're gonna put these back in here and put our little rows in there I'll put that later. So anyway, those are my two pieces for the collab this month. Like I said, go check out the other ladies. And yeah, have a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye.